Okay, what we're going to do here is put in a outdoor receptacle. There's the wire. We'll start off with a pop in box. It's got ears. Head in a little bit. You want to get it right in the center. I mean, this is not a this is not a how-to video, but alrighty. Like that. Drill a little hole. Drill a hole here. Actually, drill two holes caddy corner and turn your saw blade from one way to the other. I left my wire plenty long in there in case I cut it, I can pull it out and then to get to an area that's not damaged. Alrighty. No insulation in there because that's a garage. Now we just pull this insulation right off of there. Strip our wires. Okay, got our wire stripped. Now this is a double layer. Sometimes it's a little tricky for your pop-in box things to, to fit. I just done one and it fit. It just barely did. We'll see how that goes. Tighten these up. The little wings catch. Sometimes for added support, I put a little extra screw in there. A little condenser cut in, cut off. Easier to hear me now. This is a weather resistant, weather resistant and tamper resistant outlet. So the outlet itself is weather resistant, not just the cover. That was something new they started in 08. Alright. Let me 
two drills out here to make it. I like using the impact. Seems like it gets them real tight. We got a ground wire right there. Okay, now I'll just run this outlet up. I'm running up about halfway because I want to be able to access the screws. See, it's got a little WR right on there and TR there. And some inspectors, they will look for that. Alright, so see my screws are still poking out a little bit. And I'll take my in use cover. Already has screw, screw holes in there with little slots on them. Put it right there, like so. It's got a little clip right there. See, now all that's left to do is to caulk around the top of it. I've got seven of them to do, so I'm going to caulk them all at one time.